We did the right thing. Charles was our friend. I love you, Red McCraith. But? But when it comes to ghosts, your heart makes you reckless. It's dangerous. Were you really about to banish Charles? That wasn't Charles. That was the ghost of Charles. Charles Davenport? Our oldest friend, the man who brought us together. Our friend is dead. His ghost was a danger to his wife. Ghosts only bring misery, Red. Make no mistake, they steal life's essence from the living. Aye. They don't always do it out of malice. Give them that. We are banishers. We end suffering for those who live. We bring closure to those who don't. A ghost may suffer too. A sin puts a gentler end to it. But not a safer one. Better to banish and be sure. Would you banish me? If it came to? You'll not escape me so easy. You I would bring back from the dead. <sighs> That's not funny. I'd fill you with fresh essence. I'd give you so much essence you'd return bloated with life. Steal essence from the living to feed my ghost, <laughs> you with me. I would. Then I'd kill you again for dying before I do. Sometimes you scare me. I know. Do you think Charles was right? This thing in the meeting house could be a... How did he call it? A nightmare? I really hope not. Such entities are legendary ghosts, even for banishers. We'll see tomorrow. Now, to sleep. This was a dreadful day. Poor Charles. Poor Esther. Aye, poor Esther. Firebane. She says I'm the reckless one. Where are you? You're hardly in the meeting now, sorry. Who's there? And there? Why would you go up there alone? I'm hoping. And there? You spectres have seen Antea, have you? Bon. 
also know me could have included me. stood a chance. Antea, are you hot? Where are you? I'm here, my love. What happened? Show yourself. God came to the man in a dream and said, Behold, thou art dead. But the man had done nothing wrong and said, Lord, wilt thou also slay the righteous? bring you aid. There is no aid. There is only dereliction. Where is Antea? What have you done with her? That was Paul's. Lady, if you hurt her... You cling to love, a fool to the last. There is no love. There is only defilement. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>
If you've laid a finger on her... You're what? Come to her aid? Oh, there is no aid. There is oh, only... Oh, oh, retribution. Give him back. Oh. How touching. You come to claim your man. You think you love him. You do not. There, in the dark of your manor, there is no love, only betrayal. I offer you a trade. He stays and you leave with your life. I'll bargain with no ghost. You have a brain, yet you think with your idiot heart. You're weak. to her aid now when all is lost. If you do, I'll be waiting. The icy ocean made a diamond from his grief, then buried it in his heart. The weight of his failure dragged him down. Outside time, drowning in the gloom, he spoke her name. Take me instead, he screamed, soundless, to the cold and silent waters. Out beyond the black veil of death, something heard his cries and reached for him. Let her go. Take me instead. Let her go. Ah, you're awake. Who are you? She who rescued you. Tended you for days on end. Weeks, maybe. Weeks? Oh, God. What have I done? Get your strength back before you beat yourself up. She's dead. Yes. That's why you're here. And why I was sent to look after you. Who are you? I feel like we've met, but... I'm sure we have not. I feel like I know you forever, but... But do I? You're confused. It's normal. You've been near killed by a nightmare, you've lost your beloved, and now you've a witch by your sickbed. Witch? Witch. I go by Seeker. Find the Banisher, said my mistress. Tend him, and then answer any questions he asks you before you leave him be. So, how do you feel? Does it matter? <sighs> of course it matters. It means you're alive, and you haven't given up.
What am I to do now? How do I... How do I do it alone? You're not alone. Have faith. If Ceridian had told me more, I'd tell you it. But you must have faith. This isn't what I want. Not like this. Not without her. No one gets what they want. You get what comes. And if you survive, you get changed by it. You have a hole in you. A yawning, grimacing pit in your soul. That's love, that is. The hole won't fill because the love won't die. God, what have I done? Here's the thing. Unlike most, you get a second chance. I suggest you seize it. Why'd you pull me from the water? What's your business with me? I have no business with you, but my mistress does. Ceridian says the wall between the living and the dead is under threat. You, it seems, have a part to play. This is mine. You've lost me. No, I found you. But so did your grief. And it demands to be felt. You may think you're done with your ghosts, Red McCraith. But they aren't done with you. I'll go now. Rest. Why ever my mistress saved you, she has good reasons. The best. Where are you going? Oh, to Ceridian. She needs me. Where shall I find you if... or when I need to? Maya marshes. Great big swamps other side of the woods. You can't miss them. We'll know when you're coming. Until we meet again, then. That's right, Banisher. Now, turn around. What? I'm leaving. <laughs>